My name is Colly Pistorius. I'm the academic coordinator for the new Masters of Engineering Management degree at Stellenbosch University. Now, the structured Masters of Engineering degree, which we like to refer to as the MEM degree, is a new offering from the Faculty of Engineering at Stellenbosch University. It is primarily aimed at early to mid-career engineers and scientists who already obtained their undergraduate qualification and now have the need for more formal education to address the management-related responsibilities that they are taking on. Our students are usually working professionals and the program is hence designed to be taken as a part-time degree and it's offered in an online hybrid mode. Undergraduate degrees in engineering and sciences tend to focus on the scientific and technological principles and their applications in engineering. However, engineering also entails significant aspects of various types of management, including the management of projects, budgets, technology, innovation, processes, as well as people and places. Similarly, for many of the applied natural and life sciences, same thing. Graduate engineers are often expected to take on these managed responsibilities quite early on in their careers, and the dilemma is that they are not exposed to these as part of their undergraduate studies, for very good reason. On the one hand, undergraduate engineering curriculum is already very full. Furthermore, the experience has shown that students benefit from more management training if they have been exposed to the real world of work first. They then tend to appreciate the nature of the management-related challenges better including the inherent different nature of these management challenges, which tend to be governed by human behavior related rules and laws vis-a-vis -vis scientific and technological challenges, which are governed by the laws of nature. Now, as they increasingly take on more management related responsibilities, early to mid-career engineers and scientists quickly realize that solving science and technology challenges is only one of the elements of the task of the engineer and the scientist. They have a real and dire need for formal management education, which exposes them to the management components of the task of the engineer. They have a need for industry-relevant, just-in-time skills that equip them for the job at hand. And at the same time, this engineering management education must also lay a foundation which will serve them well for their entire career in the same manner that the undergraduate education did with regard to the scientific and technological aspects and their applications. The Masters of Engineering Management degree is designed to do just that. It aims to produce more well-rounded, better if you will, engineers and scientists by formally preparing them to address the important other element of engineering. Engineering management is recognized across the globe as an established engineering and also academic discipline, as is the master's degree in engineering management, which have come to be associated with it. Many prominent universities across the globe offer MEM type degrees, typically by the engineering faculties or schools uh, sometimes with inputs from other disciplines such as business and management schools. The nature and nuances of these degrees differ from university to university, but they essentially all have the same broad aim. Stellenbosch University is a South African university which is held in very high academic esteem all across the world, and particular also its faculty of engineering. It is fitting and appropriate then that the university introduced a new MEM degree, particularly one aimed to primarily address the requirements of mid-career engineers and scientists. During the two years preceding the launch of the new degree, the world was devastated by the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic. Practically no country, organization or individual was not touched and disrupted in some way or another. Social distancing became the norm. And as the waves of the pandemic swept and wreaked havoc on a global scale, the world also innovated as it learned and found ways to adapt. Working from home 
And also studying from home became the new normal for many, at least for a significant period. Enabling technologies advanced in leaps and bounds, prompting mindsets, work cultures and processes to keep up a pace. It became evident that remote working and studying were not only possible, but indeed viable and to some extent and in some cases preferable. It is against this background that Stellenbosch University decided to offer its new MEM degree in a hybrid online mode only. Prospective students overwhelmingly and enthusiastically embraced this delivery model, mindful that the curriculum for the new degree was developed for this delivery mode from the start. Our students are all working professionals who enroll for the degree part-time while they pursue their day jobs. As an added bonus, it also enables students from all over the country and indeed the world to enroll even when they are traveling. This diversity, of course, strengthens the student interaction and the networking considerably. Stellenbosch MEM, the Structured Masters in Engineering Management degree, is an NQF Level 9 qualification with 180 credits. One credit represents 10 nominal learning hours. Eight modules are required, of which one is an elective, and each module counts 15 credits and is offered over a 15-week semester. Students enroll part-time for two modules per semester with two semesters per year. The project, or mini-thesis, can be done in the second year together with the modules or deferred for a third year. It is against this background that we look forward to engaging with you and discuss the possibilities of our new Masters of Engineering Management degree.